uh, one of the questions was if I'm going for IVF, how many cycles are safe for me? How many cycles I can go for? And what are the side effects of IVF? So let's talk a little bit about IVF in brief. Mm -hmm. So what exactly happens? Your egg is taken, your partner's sperm is taken, right? It is fertilized outside your body. And then the embryo is implanted within your uterus. So that is what happens in IVF. Plus you'll be given injections for progesterone, for HCG, for support of the pregnancy. To maintain the pregnancy, you'll be also given injections, right? So that is what the whole process is. And then if you're less than 40 years of age, if you're in your 30s, then you can go for three full IVF cycles. And in between the IVF cycles, you, if supposing you've ended one of your IVF cycles this month, we recommend you wait another month to undergo another IVF cycle. Don't do it consecutively. At least give a one month gap before you go on for the next IVF cycle. So the, so the ovaries can replenish. If you're about... 37, 39, 38 years, then what is the success rate of one IVF cycle? It is about 20%. Now, uh, some people can get scared. 20% is a very low success rate. I want an 80% success rate, right? So that if you're naturally conceiving, every cycle, your success rate is about 20%. So if IVF is giving you that much, every cycle 20%, your cumulative after the end of three cycles, your success rate will come up to about 55%. After 40 years, you undergo only one cycle. What can be the side effects of IVF? You're taking embryos. So if more than one embryo is implanted, you can get multiple pregnancy. You're stimulating your ovary. So your, your ovary can get hyperstimulated you can land up in hypertension. There can be preterm labor, premature labor, miscarriages can be there. All these side effects can be there in IVF. 